No fancy intro. Just getting into it. The big boys got to eat. So in Miami, steak and shrimp all day, all day. Steak and shrimp. Big boys ate all day. All right, so the first play we're going to look at was the um, what I call a buck sweep ran by Justice Hill. And what you're going to get is you get this guy coming in motion. I'm not going to really draw that up. You'll see him coming in motion and try to – them to get a – to create leverage. They're going to try to create leverage on this left side. You're going to get um, – this is Boyle. He's going to down block on this guy right here. Hurst is going to down block on this guy right here. Um, who is this? Seven, is this is – this, um, God, dog, I can't think of the left guard's name now. This is Bozeman, I think. Bozeman's going to try to get this hook on this guy. And um, Yonder's going to try to scoop block this guy up out of here. What Stanley's going to do is work to second level. Anybody that comes up in here is going to try to cut him off. That's what he's going to try to do. And so you're going to get a pull from Stanley. I'm sorry, this is Zeus right here. I didn't mean to say Stanley. This is Zeus. You're going to get a pull from Stanley. You're going to get a pull from the center skirt. And they're going to basically take out anything of the opposite color. And you're going to get a, like a little toss or something to uh, Justice Hill, and you're going to try to get him outside and have the Dolphins outflanked. So um, let's go see what it looks like in live action. So this is the, the buck sweep I just drew up for you. You're going to get a motion by Andrews to kind of work leverage, and we try to get leverage on the top side of the screen. And you see where I got a pause right there. You see um, Stanley pulling. You see Skirrow pulling. And then you can kind of see these other blocks once we look at the back view. Justice here is just trying to get to the corner. Mark Andrews out there putting in good work to secure that corner. And a little 13-yard run by Justice Hill. But you get to see the new one start to play from the back. So we're going to create leverage by putting Andrews in motion. And you see he doesn't come with him. He kind of bumps it over. So if any of these guys bump out of the box, it's going to help us out because he's going to stay backside. Now I'm going to start with um, Zeus and kind of work my way down the line. Zeus is trying to cut off 29. Trying to cut this guy off right here. Make sure he doesn't get involved in the play. Because there's no sense of blocking this guy because it's a toss. Going to Yonder. Is that Yonder? That, that is not 70. Yeah, it is. Scoop blocking. Trying to scoop that guy out of there. Make sure he doesn't cross the face. Then you go to Skura. He's pulling, trying to get to the outside edge. Then you go to Bozeman. It's basically base blocking that guy and you know making sure, working to his outside shoulder, making sure he don't cross his face. Then you got Stanley, who's pulling for uh, greenery, pulling for space. But the two big blocks right here come from Boyle and come from Hurst. They're going to block down here. He's going to block him down and basically sealing this edge for, he's sealing the edge for Stanley to get out there Security to get out there, and eventually Justice Hill to get out there. But this is another use of we got all three tight ends in the game. You got Hurst, Boyle, Andrews coming in motion. Look, you got Stanley and Skura on a DB. You got Mark Andrews out there on a DB. Now watch what Mark Andrews does to the DB out here. Basically erases him, and Justice Hill scoots outside for the run. So the next play is the, the very first play of the game. Big time, you know, way to open the season. And what um, the naked eye probably didn't notice is you got tackle over. So basically you put the tight end and put him on the left side and you brought Stanley over to the right side to be the tight end. And all you're going to get is old school power. You're going to get a down block by Stanley, down block by Zeus, down block by Yonder. And they're basically going to make a wall right there. Then you're going to get a kick out from um, Ricard. Ricard's going to kick this guy out. But what's going to happen is he's going, to, he's going to do a good job of squeezing. So Ricard and this guy is going to kind of end up right there. So when who's this, um, Bozeman pulls around to try to get to the linebacker, whoever shows up, because this, this guy did a good job of squeezing, he ends up being a kick man on, I think, this dude over here. And so basically Ricard and Bozeman switch jobs. Mark Ingram realizes it on the fly and then scoops through. So this is what you're going to get. You're going to get old school power with tackle over. 
like I said a minute ago, this is the very first play of the game. This is how you set the tone for a season. This is smash mouth football at its finest. Again, tackle over and let it run through. Squirt right through there. Boy can kind of block it in the way of somebody. But you got your two rookies out there. Marquise Brown and Boykin. Now let's go to the back view. Alright, let's set it up. Alright. Now, there, here you go. You got your wall I was talking about. You got um, Yonder, Zeus, and Stanley. Watch, Just watch them and watch the wall they set up. See, look at that. There it is. There's that wall I talked about. Now, ideally, you will want Ricard to have this guy out here and have him kicked out so that, you know, Ingram can fit through that nice hole right there. But, you know, he's fighting with this guy. This guy did a good job of squeezing, like I said earlier. So, Bozeman on the fly realizes, hey, this guy's free because the guy he's really supposed to block is over here in the wash because he's getting he's caught up in this, this massive wall of purple right here. So, Bozeman's just going to, you know, kind of pass him by and be athletic, go kick this guy out, and, and Ingram's going to scoot right through there. Bam, right there. Now, that's it. So, technically, you know, he could have fit that hole, but he'd have to deal with the safety. Now he fits this hole, and he can kind of run away from the safety. So good, good vision and also a good job of adapting and adjusting by uh, Bozeman. And it's off to the races. Might be a touchdown if um, if Boy can get this block. If Boy can, can be in front of him and Ingram can cut off of it, maybe outside. Might have went for six instead of just 49. But Ingram did a good job of bouncing off people and turning on what lit Jets he got left. Opening run of the season, fantastic. Great way to start the season. Great way to start the season. So the next run, we got a 10-yard run by um, Gus Edwards. And it's, it's late. Ryan says it's late in the game, but it's when we took um, Lamar out. But I still want to, you know, emphasize the, the way the O-line, you know, did their thing the entire game. And it's, look like, it's just an inside zone, and Gus sees the cutback and run through it, but the the back view kind of tells the story. So let's talk about this for a second. You got uh, Andrews here. He's going to take off and run to kind of widen this guy out. You get a double team by Macari and Zeus. Um, I'm not sure who this is at center right now. But you get a base block here. Bozeman and Stanley's going to, you know, basically zone block. These These going to be man blocks. Man block there, man block there, man block there. Double team up to whoever shows up. All right. You see Andrew's going to take off. He, he takes off. This guy widens, which opens a huge lane. Look at this double team. Hip to hip. Hip to hip. And this is, man, this is textbook. Hold on. Let me take a picture. Okay. Got the picture taken. Now, it's textbook double team. Hip to hip. You got a man here. Man, they're taken care of. So, technically, they're supposed to double team to this guy. And watch Gus. You know, he Gus is looking at this guy, reading it, reading it, reading it. And I think he probably maybe reading the nose to see if they get moving on the nose. But once he sees this alley, watch how he stick his foot in the ground. Right there. And burst through. Run away from arm tackle. And then he gets tackled right there for a 10-yard gain. Great vision by Gus. Great, um, just a great double team. The double team will set that run off. The double team and Andrews widening out to open the lane. This is a perfect time to give this video a thumbs up. And while you're down there, make sure you go ahead and click that subscribe button. Thanks. So this next play I want to show you is, is power again, but it's, it's in a way that I have never seen done. You're going to get, basically you're going to get a motion power, and the guy that's in motion is going to be the um, the kickout block. I was impressed when I saw it, and I'm still impressed looking at it again. So but this is Ricard right here, and why would you commit like a DB to Ricard? I do not know. This is the oddest looking, well, I'm, I'm lying. This is a pretty good receiver stance. For a D line, pretty good receiver stance. So he's gonna come in motion. So now he's coming in motion to kick out the end. All these guys are gonna watch down, and you're gonna pull it right here. So this is power with a motion guy. Bam! Kick out on the end. You get your your wrap up in there, and you get it for eight yards. You get in for eight yards. So let's see what's on the line. A lot of beef up here. 
you got um a regular O line. These five right here. You got um. Well, actually, you know, this is RG three is in the game. So these two got you got Macari, and I'm still not sure who the, who 68 is. I gotta uh, look that up. But you got um Yonder's out. You got a new center in. No, uh, that's Skrill. That is Skrill. I'm, I'm tripping. I'm tripping. And so um based on the personality is Yonder. And you got your two tight ends right here, and you're gonna bring Ricard in motion. So you're gonna get down blocks from all these guys. From one, two, three, four, five. You're gonna get down blocks from five guys. You're gonna get Skrill. I mean not Skrill. You're gonna get um Ricard to kick this guy out, and Ingram's gonna fit it up in there. So come on in motion. So come in motion. You see both of them kind of at the same time. But Ricard's going to pass him because he's he's running right now. So you got Bozeman and Ricard coming to the right side. Bozeman coming to kick out that guy on the outside. He's, he's supposed to be picking up the first thing outside of Hurst. That's that guy. Boom. Now, great job by um, Hurst to seal this off. Great job. Is this Boyle or Andrews? Let me go back so I can see what this is. That is Boyle. I should have known. That's Boyle. Look, look at him sticking his hat in there. Biting his shoulder pad. Perfect down block. If you was here with me last year, you know what the biting the shoulder pad means. Biting the shoulder pad. Perf perfect position right there. Great position by Boyer. Andrews coming coming up. He got good position. Got good leverage. Record with the kick out. Bozeman and Ingram right through the hole. Right through the hole. For like a nine yard gain. Um, Bozeman, is, I think he's going to end up blocking this guy and he's going to make the tackle or he's going to block this guy and this guy going to make the tackle. Now, I forgot. Let me go back to the front view and see. Bring it on back. Bring it on back. Come on. Come back with me. There we go. So Bozeman goes to the – okay, that's the linebacker to come in there and slow him down. And they finish him up. And both of those guys clean him up we were talking about. So the linebacker gets in there a little bit. And this guy and this guy over here kind of cleans him up. This is Coach Evans from Sip the Tally Films. Make sure you go on over to teespring.com and get some of the merch we have lined up. Get your FTMF shirts, uh, stands for Film There More Film, or Fruit Tomatoes and More Fruits. Then you can pop on over and get your athlete shirt for all those former athletes that mentally we still got it, physically we just don't have it anymore. Then you can look, check out the different products I have with the Ravens Roundup design on them. T-shirts, sweatshirts, uh, cell phone cases, all that good stuff. And again, this is Coach Evans, and I appreciate you. Salute. So on this next play, you're going to get good old-fashioned Raven staple from last year once Lamar started playing split zone. Split zone. You're going to get Ricard coming in motion. Kick that backside in. Double um, Zone blocking to the right. Running back, find, it, find the space and hit it. Staple from last year. This is one of Gus's runs last year. But it's Ingram in there now. So Ricard, he already cutting his eyes down here to kind of see who he's going to block. So, Ricard's guy is 55. Everybody else is zoning right. So, I would say this is, is that 86. Boyle's going here. Um, Zeus is going. Is that Zeus? Yeah, Zeus is going there. Yonder here. Um, Bozeman and Skurik are going to double to this guy. And you might get a little scoop block here from him just to seal him off. Not sure. Let's see how that plays out. Come in motion. So, so far so good. Man block, man block, man block. About to be a double. And you're going to get a little scoop here. Ricard's coming to block this guy. So, the running back's reading probably this nose. He's going to see this linebacker flash here. And he's going to cut it back to the other way. See the white flash? They head up. Now he's going to jump cut and go the other way. Look at that. Great vision by Ingram. Great vision. Simple little jump step. Hit the hole. Great vision. The initial hole is here because of the double team. He sees the linebacker fitting up in there, which is it's a good fit. Good fit by the linebacker. Better better cut by the running back, though. Better vision. Get through there. Simple. Simple. And this play really just relies on the vision of the running back. Guys in this hole, jump cut, go. That's beautiful. Great football right there. Everybody off sustaining the blocks. Nobody's, you know, the only guy that really even comes off is 94 kind of throws. Um, who is this again? 94 throws. Yonder out the way. 
and falls in to make the tackle. Kind of presses Yonder a little bit. Now Yonder's probably in, in a good position right here, hands inside. That guy, and I guess he just got off balance a little bit. But right there, that's a good fit right there by Yonder. That's perfect right there by Yonder. But I guess he got off balance and the guy was able to throw him out the way and fall in and kind of trip up Ingram. So imagine Yonder stays in this great position right here. Let's see if anybody else is there. Nope, and nobody's there. So this nine yard game probably could be, cause this guy, this guy not gonna make the tackle. The only guy who would have a chance of making the tackle is him. This would be a 10, 15 yard game. But another good patient running by, by Ingram and, and this is a base play. This is nothing fancy, nothing you know tricky. This is a base play for the Ravens, and we were getting chunks of yards off base plays against the Dolphins. Now everybody's saying it's because it's the Dolphins. They're the suckiest team in the league. They're still paid professionals. And I know they didn't want, didn't, well, they didn't enjoy getting a 59 burger put on them. So, you know, anybody that's paid in the NFL can, can ball and they just got blasted Sunday. I'm sure they'll come back. Um, well, now they play the Patriots this week. So I'm not going to even say that statement. But anyway, they stepped on the field. We thrashed them. Hey, it is what it is. And this is another episode of uh, Sip the Tatter Presents Ravens Roundup. Again, this is season two. If this is your first time here, hit the uh, subscribe button and hit the like button. I come, uh, reply to comments as much as possible, and I appreciate the comments. I like the dialogue going back and forth. And, again, if you um, don't have any Sip the Tally merchandise, hit the Teespring site. And, again, it's Coach Evans. I appreciate you. I'm out. Till next time.